In this video, we'll look at the type of reaction for zinc plus hydrochloric acid, that's Zn plus HCl. So when we look at it, we have zinc, a metal by itself, and then hydrochloric acid. This is an acid. So this is going to be what we call a single replacement or single displacement reaction, where the zinc, that's going to come in and it's going to push the hydrogen out. And what we'll end up with is hydrogen over here, and the zinc will be with the chlorine. We can check and see if this happens by looking at a activity series here. So we can see that zinc is right here. It's actually above the hydrogen. So the zinc is more reactive. So it will be able to push out the hydrogen and then bond with the chlorine. But we're not quite done writing this reaction because we need to take a look at the periodic table, figure the charges out, especially for this ionic compound here. So let's look at the periodic table. So on the periodic table, we can look and see that hydrogen right here, that's in group one. All of these have a positive charge. Chlorine over here, that has a negative charge. When we look at our products, zinc, that's kind of strange. Zinc is a transition metal, but it's always two plus. So since it's always two plus, and we said that chlorine is negative, we're going to need two chlorines so that it balances out this two plus. We have two times the one minus gives us two plus. And then for hydrogen, we don't normally find hydrogen just as an H atom. It's almost always bonded with another hydrogen to give us H2. So that gives us the reaction here. This is our single displacement reaction, where zinc comes in, pushes the hydrogen out. Now the hydrogen's here, and the zinc is with our chlorine. The zinc is bonded to the chlorine. Single replacement reaction. One last thing to balance this equation, all we really need to do is put a 2 as our coefficient in front of HCl then it's balanced. This is Dr. B, and thanks for watching.